Hello there, I'm Chris and welcome to another episode of Sword Assisted Unboxing. I just filmed two episodes and yeah, it's it's amazing. In this one, we're going to take a look at a freaking amazing tripod actually. This is the Roll Eye Traveler number one carbon, top of the line, pretty much. This video is of course sponsored by Viral Good. So if you're looking for an epic hand spinner or even an unweaponized version of the destroyer sword, definitely check out my shop. So I thought, let's just chill. Let's just relax for a second, maybe, and just go easy on this one. Actually, pretty funny as well because it's so stupid. Oh, I should have just smashed it right here. Oh, so lame. This is so lame. Whatever. Yeah, I was completely right. Compact Traveler number one carbon. Heck yeah. Oh, what the heck? Oh, they give you a strap. Cool. They also give you tools in a clamp it on your thing, uh, baggy. Nice. Amazing. What the heck is that like? Uh. Is this for the arm? Ah! Hey, this is actually cool. Only care about this thing anyways. All in all, this seems like top-notch equipment. That's the thing right there. This is actually a bit bigger than expected, but it's still freaking tiny and it is actually fairly light. 980 grams, so almost one kilogram, goes up to 142 centimeters and this thing is apparently 33 centimeters long. And again, I will use this first and foremost in combination with my new action camera because, you know, just leaning it against something is just a huge pain in the ass. This might solve it. If you're interested in my user experience with this thing, definitely check out the corresponding vlog. This is so thin, oh my god. I will link the vlog in the description and in the cards. I think this thing will do great. One-handed action, heck yeah, I like that. Two, three, four. Okay, that's one of the drawbacks, of course. You have four screws and it's still not very long, but that's what you get when you buy a tiny tripod. Goes up like to my chest almost. Okay, when you unfold it and it gets bigger, you know, it kind of tricks you. This feels so light right now, it's crazy. This thing looks so good. Red accents, black, it's, it's so light, it's amazing. This thing is so cool. It was kind of expensive, but worth it. Oh my God, my softbox is making weird noises since I hit it with my sword. What the heck is it doing? Oh, you can go for smooth tilts. No, it's pans, I guess. Whatever, you, you can turn it very smoothly. Up here is, of course, a ball that you can tighten and loosen. Okay, that's cool, that's amazing. Freaking sick thing. I don't know what to do with all this gear. I would probably just store it in a corner and never use it. What I can tell is that it looks amazing, it feels amazing, and I hope it will also perform amazing and not break when someone stumbles over it. And this pretty much concludes this episode of Sword Assisted Unboxing. If you enjoyed this video, you know what to do, right? Hit that like button right now and leave a comment or question below because I love answering them. And a subscribe for the viral vibe, oh yeah.